I'm not going to make excuses for Bandai Namco on this one. They should have tried to bring back all the original voice actors for Vesperia Definitive. Troy Baker wasn't even approached and that is just a garbage move. But what I'm going to tell you is that the English voiceover and the voice actor swapping isn't really a problem. I've already seen at least one article blow the whole situation way out of proportion and when you do start to break it down and explain it in theory, it sounds god awful. Focusing on Yuri, all the original Troy Baker lines are there, but there is a substantial amount of new content from the Japanese exclusive PS3 version in Vesperia Definitive, and all the lines in this new content are provided by Grant George. So yes, Yuri's voice actor switches throughout the story, and I was expecting it to be insanely jarring but that just isn't the case. I'm going to play you two voice lines. Try and guess which one is the original and which is brand new. I'm Yuri, what's your name? Should we head back or? I'm Yuri, what's your name? Should we head back or? There was a reason that I used only the audio clips for that, and that is because most of the time, the giveaway for which is the new one is entirely visual. Every scene with Patty is obviously done with Grant George, and that's what makes you notice any minor differences in the voices. It isn't the voice itself, which is by and large spot on. You could mistake a lot of it for Troy Baker simply making an acting choice, rather than it being an entirely new voice actor. Yeah, the stench is sort of coming off you in waves. <laughs> it's not like I really care anyway. Even if Troy did reprise his role, the new voice lines would be slightly different. A lot can change in 10 years, and it's a hell of a long gap between performances of the same character. Like I said at the beginning, I'm not making excuses for Bandai Namco. They should have at least asked Troy to reprise the role, but I have to be completely honest with you, and the honest truth is, I haven't found it jarring, and I really don't have an issue with the final product. I won't lie, there are a few lines that do sound more different than they should. Hold up, you, you've come this far and now you're just gonna run away? But I've been reviewing some 10 hours of gameplay I've captured so far and examples like this are in the very small minority. For the most part, Yuri just sounds like Yuri. I hope you're right. Still, it's not like worrying's gonna change anything. Now maybe your ears are more sensitive than mine, and if you personally find it annoying, you do have the option of playing with the Japanese voiceover, which doesn't suffer from these voice actor swaps. Just don't immediately write off the English voiceover because somebody wrote an overblown article or review complaining about what I found to be an incredibly trivial issue. Experience it for yourself before passing judgement. Given the circumstances, I think Grant George did a pretty good job. I guess that means she'll be fine on her own. Thanks for liking, subscribing, and sharing, and I'll see you all soon.